Hello everyone, I have gotten the kids off to school and I stopped for some groceries, but now it is time for me to meet a friend for coffee and a late breakfast. It is almost 10. Bring in some crochet. Going to Panera, I haven't been there in a long time since we last met up. I think before Christmas. So. They do stop selling all their breakfast things at 10.30 and I'm meeting her at 10.15. So I'm gonna leave now and hopefully get there a few minutes early just to give myself a little buffer. But yeah, it is freezing out there. So I need to bundle up and get going. Hello, Henry. Hello, Henry. Oh, he's such a good boy. I think I have one more. No, two more cookies. He's a good boy. You want to go inside? Yeah, let's go inside. Oh, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. There we go. Oh, you want your kibbles now? Because you had a snack. You can eat your kibbles. What's going on at this door? There we go. Oh, he's the bestest boy. Is he the bestest boy? Yes, he is. Yes. Hello, everyone. Here's Henry. He's such a sweetie. Oh, you're such a sweetie. Yes, watch that happy tail. We are here giving him some love. Oh, he has some big old biscuits over there. You got some biscuits. You got some biscuits. Are you all by yourself? Do you want me to bring Sebastian over? When he gets home, oh, yes, you're a good boy. Yes, you're a good boy. Oh, you want some tummies. Oh, you want some tummies. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Okay, I've got some important tummy rubs to give. Look at this baby. Look at that baby. Oh my goodness. Why are you so sweet? Why are you so sweet? Puppy ASMR. How am I supposed to go be productive when you're so sweet? Oh, yeah, sorry, he just scratched you guys. <gasps> Look at this baby. Oh, I think I have to stay. Oh my goodness. Puppy. Thursday night. Dan is out at a brewery. I've got everybody up here getting ready for bed. And yeah, today I got everybody off the school as you saw, and then I headed out to meet my friend. Then we got all caught up, shed some tears. It's still really hard talking about my family member, but. He's doing good. He's doing good. Anyway, 
and then I came home and went into what would be my studio room, the craft room. What? What? Where are you? So get something out of your drawer. You know where your jammies are. Anyway, I was in here. I moved things to a possible location. Though this rocker will probably eventually go back into the bedroom. Maybe I'll paint it this brown color that I've been doing. Piggy, go! Eventually. <laughs> Because I would want my comfy one. So I feel like this is where I would want my standing easel. So I don't know. I don't think a rocker goes well right here because it's kind of like a pathway. So it would have to be something I play with. I feel like the rocker has to go in the corner. And then the easel would have to be here, which would mean I would need a cart beside it. But I don't need to put the big easel up right away. I do have a tabletop easel, which will probably go here. But what I did is sorted through some more books and... What are you doing? Hey, wait a minute. I don't know. <laughs> He's been interrupting all day. I brought out a box of donations for now. Oh, I disassembled the crib. <laughs> that let me be able to move furniture, so. It is over here, all these pieces. I need to hopefully get rid of that. And. It's just really dark in here. I need to order some light bulbs that don't suck. Cause there's one that works, but it's yellow. One that barely works. And one that's completely dead. And the lamp is absolute garbage too. So I don't know, maybe I need to order a lamp. I'm trying to make do. I'd eventually want a chair that's more comfortable and can go up and down and turn instead of this thrifted one that I've painted two different colors now. It's a little low to the table. But I finished painting this. It just needs a second coat in spots. And I... I'm a totally different one. Okay. I've yeah. a lot more, but... Yeah, they used to be your brothers. Whoa. Go take your stuff. I did start sanding this. And Danny says he has an electric sander I can use. And... I'm trying to not spend money on paint, which means I was trying to look through what we have, but we just don't have enough of anything. I need it to be neutral and light colored so it doesn't give a cast onto my paintings. This will give a bluey green cast onto everything. And this would affect it too, so this is going white, unless I absolutely hate it, then I'll just go dark brown. But Yvonne, Supposedly has extra paint and he has a pale gray blue Which would work fine. I just don't know if he has this much paint. This is a lot of paint It would be nice to do An accent wall, so I'm still thinking about everything um, Let me show you a picture that I drew when I was maybe 16 or 17 we had a big snow and ice storm that closed school for so long. <laughs> I was just at home. I, at least a week, maybe a week and a half. Nobody was going anywhere. I set up my oboe, a lace tablecloth, and some sheet music on our kitchen table and just all day long, many, many hours, multiple days was drawing. And I have the original. We also had it photographed. This is kind of yellowing, so. This is framed, but there's the photos or negatives or something that my dad put there. Can you wait, please? So I will show you on the front cam. Here is 
the elbow. There's the reed. Had it sitting on the music. I had the music laid out upside down. This is a cover of another one of my books. And I just went ahead and drew it just like it was. Upside down. And then I drew all this lace, including the texture. I don't know if you can see that. I just went to macro mode. So like in these areas, there's the texture of the woven lace. Oh yes, I cleaned oboe. I still have my oboe, but it's been a very long time. And the water is yeah, this was many hours, <laughs> many hours of work. But I think I'm gonna hang it up in here. Anyway, I need to get him to bed. Why aren't you taking your stuff? I will show you the very unexciting envelope. Ooh, it's an envelope. Wow. Ooh, wow. Secret envelope. Go take your stuff. Wow. But this is where we are. I made progress. So I might order a mini roller because that would work better at making a smooth top. Light bulbs, maybe a few bins because I know I can just stack yarn in here. It's not really clean, so I don't really want to do. I'm using this basket temporarily. I can stack yarn, but I have a lot of projects that are always go in so it'd be nice to have some bins we can also keep art supplies i'll keep picking away there's a ton of crap in the closet that needs to be gone through a lot of old clothes that are too small for sebastian and yeah that's my update i just did this and then i got him from the bus stop we did some homework we had some drama and then I had to go out and get Jack's for school. Less drama there. <laughs> but yeah, then I was back up here with the one same old. And Danny was not feeling our dinner choices, so I just made dinner for myself and the kids and he went ahead to the brewery. I don't know that they have food there, but it is what it is. And now we're going to do reading and get him to bed, so it's time to say goodnight. I brought this lamp up, it's my painting light downstairs. It'll be nice to have natural light, because that's the main problem downstairs, and I want that to be his homework station, where he can spread out a little more. Come on! Right now, he just dumps on one half of the table, and my stuff's on the other half, so... This should be a good solution for everyone. Oh, and <laughs> I have a box that I got eBay stuff in ages ago, probably like around Christmas, the year before this past one. And you need to move, you're in the way. <laughs> Let me show you this box. It says, whoop, there it is. The winner's pack is here. And it says, become number one in number two, colon broom. And then it says in here, get shit done. Wait, what? <laughs> this box was originally for some medicine that, that made you poop so much that you had no more poop left in you. Oh. It's called a colon cleanse. <laughs> so somebody legit sent me probably Bionicles in a box for colon cleanse. Yeah, back when I was getting you all your little Christmas bionicles. That was on the box. <laughs> I totally didn't notice until I grabbed that empty box to put books in. So yeah, I'm gonna donate books in a colon cleanse box. But <laughs> pass on the love. On that note, I'm gonna say goodnight because I gotta get into bed. I need to pick up my clothes for tomorrow. I'll be at the middle school hosting a luncheon, so I gotta dress a little bit nicer. And we will see you tomorrow. Stay safe, be kind, and don't forget. Wash your hands. Wash your hands.